Hi everyone, this is Emily with DEK Designs and Plan to be Fab and welcome to another plan with me. Last week I did not do one. I actually sliced my nail, this nail off. <laughs> Long story. Anyway, it was not pretty. So I decided that you guys probably didn't want to see that and this plan with me is a little late. I usually do them either Sunday nights or Mondays, but better late than never, right? So this week I am doing a kit called, sorry, uh, Beach Please. And I know it's not summer yet, but I'm so looking forward to it. And so I want to use this kit and I love the colors in it. And this kit is actually free all week on our Etsy shop, which is plantobefab.com. So if you go there, you can get this kit for free when you spend $15, which is pretty easy to do. <laughs> so this is the full boxes. And of course it's mermaid themed. You have an ice cream cone with the mermaid tail coming out of it, some uh, brush makeup brushes and a shell, the hand, the mermaid, and then call me on my shell. <laughs> and it's silver foil, so you get a free kit when you spend 15. Here are your half boxes and habit trackers. Your checklists, and I used these two already. I always put the washi down before I do my videos just because I'm so weird about it. <laughs> Your date covers and washi. And your headers and glitter headers. And some deco and flags in the weekend banner. All right, so I'm going to get started. I did post in, like I do every time in our Facebook group, if you have any questions for me, so I will be pulling those up soon. There wasn't many questions, but that's okay. I can just go off on a tangent here if you're cool with that. <laughs> and I do have some functional stickers sitting next to me. I'm not sure if I'm going to use a lot yet I'm just going to play it by ear and see if I want to use them I love this quote make waves though I decided to use that in this kit because it's kind of like it reminds me of okay make waves get sh excuse my language earmuffs if kids are watching get shit done, you know, make waves, do your thing. Let's do this this week. So I really love that quote. These are my, some of my favorite colors in this kit. I really love the bright purple and pink and blue. Let's see. Yeah, but I hope everyone is having a good week so far. I feel weird doing this on a Tuesday, but like I said, better late than never. And it's like therapeutic to me to do a plan with me. So. I like to I like to do the full boxes first for the most part. Kind of sets the tone for the whole spread for the week. Whoop. 
Wow, my hands are shaky today. There we go. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, what's nice about our stickers is that if you are a little off, you can peel it off and put it back on. Story of my life. <laughs> Anyway, it's finally starting to get nicer out. Oh my gosh. You just like have a completely different mindset when the sun is out longer and the weather is nicer. I took my dog. She is a golden doodle. <laughs> she is crazy. Anyway, I have never seen her so happy before. I just took her on a walk. Uh... What was it? Oh my gosh, it's still crooked. I took her on a walk on Sunday on the, on the trail behind my parents' house and I have never seen her so happy before. <laughs> so I took her on a walk. This is a crazy story actually. <laughs> I was so upset with her. So I took her on a walk on the trail and then I let her, I live in an apartment, so then I took her in my parents' backyard and let her run around in the backyard. They have a fenced, back, fenced backyard, so I let her run around. And she was so happy just running around like a crazy lady. So then I, uh... was on my way home. So I had her in the back seat of my car and we were, I, well, we, I was driving and I was going 25 miles an hour in the neighborhood, you know, and I had the window rolled down because it was a really nice day and I, I try to be like really careful with how low I roll it down, but <laughs> her crazy ass saw a dog, two dogs actually, there are two dogs, and there's this like older couple walking their two dogs, and <laughs> she barked at them at the dogs. Well, she usually does that. She acts all tough, but she really isn't. So she barked at these dogs and the, the older couple. And all of a sudden, I just look at my rear, rear view mirror and see... <laughs> all I see is her butt jumping out of my window and her leash like following her. And I was like, oh my god. She jumped out of my freaking window and she acts tough but she isn't she literally jumped out and just sat in the middle of the street in the neighborhood <laughs> like oh god what did i just do she was in big trouble after that i'm just happy that she didn't like hurt herself because that was Jumping out of a vehicle going 25 miles an hour and <laughs> I, I, I have no idea. I, I'm i still baffled by it. When she did it, I was just like, what do I do? Because it was so in the moment and I, my mind was like, what <laughs> is happening right now? Wow. And I felt so bad for the couple because they like picked their dogs up and were like, is she okay? And I was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. <laughs> so she lost her window privileges for now. I mean, does anyone else, has anyone else experienced that before? I don't, I don't know. Is my dog, my dog just weird? I, I mean, I partially blame myself because I thought the window was 
up enough that she wouldn't be tempted to do something like that. But wow, I, wow. I'm just really happy she wasn't hurt because that would have been a very expensive vet bill. Yeesh. I kind of just went off on a tangent there. <laughs> but I thought you would enjoy that story for some reason. But she's okay. She knew she was in trouble when we got home to my apartment. She just put her head down and walked straight to her kennel and just sat in there by herself for like a half hour because <laughs> she knew she messed up. Dogs, I tell you, they do the weirdest things. It's like having a child almost. I mean, I can't really contest to that because I don't have a child, but they're crazy. They do weird stuff. But yeah, these kits have everything you need for the week, but I do love a lot of our functional stickers, so I think I'm going to use a few of them once I get this straightened out. Okay. Let's start putting the headers down. Then I'll have more of an idea. I don't know if you can hear that in the background, but sounds like some ambulances are driving by. <laughs> okay, like I said, I didn't get that many questions or topics to talk about for this week's plan with me, which is totally, I was kind of expecting that because I didn't do one last week, but let me pull them up really quick here. If I can. <laughs> oh goodness. Let's see. Oh, come on, Internet. All right, it's going to be another second. Until then, I'm going to keep putting these headers down and talking about random stuff. But yeah, this kit, like I said, is free all week. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do for Freebie Friday next week, or this week, sorry, hello, for the next Freebie Friday. So this is free until this Friday coming up is what I should have said. After that, I'll have a new freebie Friday. I like the glitter headers better than the, oops, wow, that's crooked, better than the headers that already have words on it. I don't know why. That's just how I roll. I know everyone's different, but I've been noticing a lot lately that people have not been using the headers that have words on it and more just the glitter headers. So that's been interesting. Like on my freebie Friday last week, it was called Sea Witch and I did not have any headers that had words on it already. I just had glitter headers on it. So I'm curious if you like those better or what, because I've been noticing that trend lately. All right, is my internet working now? <laughs> Let's see. 
Nope. Okay. Maybe I won't get to your questions. That's disappointing. There's only like three. And if not, I'll answer them next week. I'll still refresh my phone though to see if I can get to them. Oh, here we go. Okay. <clears throat> Sarah asks, do you have any favorite family traditions? We don't honestly have too many. Um, I mean, I guess the holidays when we celebrate are pretty fun, but we don't really have that many traditions. Um, maybe my favorite would be Christmas when we all get together and eat our faces off and <laughs> have drinks and hang out all together because now that we're all grown up and don't live together, which is going to change soon actually. It's nice to have everyone in the same room and just hang out and whatnot. So, especially when it's like not work related, just everyone just clearing their head and hanging out and playing games and all that stuff. I would have to say that would be my favorite is around Christmas time for family traditions. Fourth of July is pretty fun too, which is also my birthday. <laughs> I love summer. If I can live somewhere where it was like 500 degrees all the time, I freaking would. Winter is the worst. Ugh. But I love Fourth of July, not only because it's my birthday, but because it's fun to hang out with family like growing up as a kid it really sucked having your birthday on a holiday because all your friends were busy with family stuff so you didn't really get to hang out with them but oh well what can you do you can't choose the day you're born on <laughs> But I loved it because, you know, you're, like I said, with Christmas, your family just hangs out and relaxes and you get to see everyone at one time, so, and eat really good food. Kelly asked, do you like to play bingo? <laughs> I actually haven't done that in a while. I The last time I did that was at a state fair in Nebraska. Uh, like a county over. And it was pretty fun. I mean, I really haven't done it since then. I, I honestly don't even know where I would do it at here. But I did it at a state fair a few years ago and it, it was fun. I mean... I'd do it again, I guess, but yeah. And that's funny, the next question that she asked was, do you like state fairs? If you have been, do you have a memory to share? But yes, yeah, uh, I have been to state fairs. It's been a while since I have been. I used to have a, one of my like best friends in high school, me and her used to go every single year, but life happens and so love her to death, of course, but we just haven't really talked that much lately and I haven't been to one for a few years, so, but yeah, I, I do like them. They're fun. It's a good people watching scene, I'll tell you that. <laughs> so, the only one I have 
been to was like the Sarpy County one that we have here in Nebraska. Nebraska is so exciting. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make my weekend banner. But those are the only questions I had, which is totally fine. I can just talk for days about random stuff, and I'm sorry if you don't like it, but <laughs> I'm a random, very a random. So I finally got to watch that Bohemian Rhapsody movie. Well, I tried to watch it. We tried to watch it, but I couldn't, I was really, I like hyped myself up for it and I was really excited, but I just couldn't, I don't know why I couldn't get into it. Maybe I'll have to watch it again. I know I've talked about this in one of my other plans with me is a while ago. So I wanted to update you on that, but man, I, I couldn't finish it. I don't know, maybe I have to watch it when I'm more awake and can pay more attention because I was like really tired when I try to watch it. And the acting, of course, is like amazing and stuff like that, but I just, for some reason, I couldn't get into it. I don't know. I'll give it another go though. I'm willing to do that. See, I'm very random. I just talk about random stuff. <laughs> Man, I love these freaking colors so much. It makes me so happy and so excited for summertime. I can't wait. Like, seriously, I'm so over this cold weather and rainy weather and ugh. So over it. And trust me, we don't need more rain. I mean, the whole state is pretty much flooded in Iowa, so we don't really need any more. So seeing the sun is like, oh my gosh, what is this? It still exists? <laughs> yeah. Seeing the sun makes me happy. And today it's all cloudy and ugh, again, of course. But oh well, you can't control mother nature. That'd be really cool if you could. Oh, that sticker almost walked away from me. There we go. What do I want to put there? Oh God, yeah, it's the first. Well, yesterday was, right? I don't even know what day it is. Yesterday was the first, so I should probably put a bill tracker down here. Yay, adulting is so fun. <laughs> You know what's funny? Like when you're growing up as a kid and you couldn't wait to be an adult and do whatever you wanted to do and all that cool stuff. Yeah. I realize it's not really like that. <laughs> well, it is, but not as fun as you pictured it in your head. Now you have all these responsibilities and fun stuff. I wouldn't even call it fun stuff. I miss being a kid sometimes. Those are some good times. <laughs> R.I.P. childhood. Okay. And Wednesday. Okay, let's get the... Alright, so Wednesday, tomorrow is hump day. Happy mail. And Friday is Freebie Friday. Oh, whoops, that's not, there's Friday. So every week on our website on Wednesday, there is a free kit with a 
minimum purchase. And same with Friday, except for it's on our Etsy shop. There is a free kit with a minimum purchase, which is this one that I'm showing you today. Let's see, what else can I use? Some deco. Hmm. Sometimes it's like a hard decision to pick where you want to put these. Okay. And the shell. I'm going to put it right here. I love this hand. Put it right here. Like on a Monday stop. Okay. Hmm. And then I'll use one more. Okay. Let's look at these functional stickers. Which can I use? So we have new functional stickers that um, are a character called Mia, and she's super freaking cute, so I think I'm going to use a couple of her. So just to give you a glance, this is what I had on the side to see which ones I wanted to use. So yesterday was kind of... Ugh disappointing to me. I'm doing my best to get back into the gym and get back into shape. And I just felt so ugh, disappointed and ugh. so I'm going to, <laughs> I saw this one and it cracked me up. <laughs> like just bloated and ugh. so I'm going to put her there just to kind of track how my mood was yesterday. Let's see, what else can I use? I think I have to go to the grocery store on Wednesday. So I'm going to use this one right here. What else? We don't need to do any more of that after yesterday. <laughs> oh, meal prep. Let's see, I can put that on. Sunday is probably the best day for me to do that. So I'm gonna put her right there. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to be drinking at some point this weekend. <laughs> These are so cute. So I'm going to put one on Friday. Let's do Friday. As I'm talking about working out and eating better. Oh, it's fine. People deserve beer on Friday. Okay. I think those are the only ones I want to use this time. Oh, yeah. But yeah, these are Mia. And yesterday I was pretty drained, so I'm going to use this one on Monday. Mm, I want to use more of these, but I don't know how I'm going to feel on the next day. So I'll probably add these in as the week goes on. Okay, so here is my week in my Erin Condren using Beach Please. And like I said, this is free on our Etsy shop if you spend $15 and you get to choose either your Erin Condren size or your Happy Planner size. And it comes with 
silver foil on it. Thank you so much for joining me on another plan with me. If you have any questions, make sure to put those in the comments below or if you just want to comment, go on ahead. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up and if you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel so every time we do post something, you get notified and sometimes we won't even do a plan with me. Sometimes we'll have like our new releases. We're going to start doing videos of that or specials and stuff like that. So thank you again, everyone. Have a great rest of your week.